Shalom, all the praises on and glory be unto Yahweh, Bashem Yahweh Shai, Bashem Rakha Kadash, that will not unto the ill, Lord's apostles, good Muslim, Shalom, to the sincere Akim, across of our wings with us, so Yahweh Yahweh, Bashem Yahweh Shai, scattered us across of, okay, in these last days, all right, as we, we have been, we, uh, as we have been set up, set in order in front of the eyes of our enemies, the main head of the serpent, the enemy being Esau, Edom, the so-called white man, African, Abu, uh, Caucasians, whatever force of pretenses of name, they may they might be going under. Okay, the French, the British, these are the devil that the Bible speaks of. Or right, the quick response to this article says that South Africa facing mass uh, starvation and riots after white uh, people's land seized. Uh, reading from this article, if you're not careful, you want to think actually the land has been has been seized already, and that's not the case. Uh, this is part of Esau's propaganda, trying to make uh, the whole world to feel sorry for him. All right, more to show you that Esau, man, he's the wicked, all right, and a fucking liar, a deceiver. All right, when, when an enemy speak lies, he speak of his own, all right. It says uh, South, South Africa facing mass starvation and riots after white uh, people's land seized, okay, because uh, about uh, two, three days ago, Cyril, uh, Cyril Ramaphosa made an announcement, okay, that uh, the ruling party, the NC, the African National Congress, is going to go ahead, okay, with the the, the, the proposed uh, am amendment of the Constitution, okay, to, to expropriate land without compensation, okay, after after all these different provinces, all nine provinces, okay, there have been now uh, public hearings, okay, on, on open to the public to hear what, uh, whether... What, what, what is their take on, on, on land expropriation without compensation? And guess what? The numbers do not lie. Okay. The majority, okay, of, of the so-called South Africans, okay, majority of which is uh, Canaanites, the descendants of Ham, amongst amongst them, you got Israel scattered anyway. Uh, they've, 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 uh, they are for the notion of that, of the constitution being amended. Okay. So now... The bid has been, it's been, it's what has been processed right now, okay, for, for the laws to be um, um, amended. So now this article, they're making as if, uh, no, there's all chaos coming, uh, happening right now. The worst is yet to, to happen right now. And this image is over here, you see, is from the, the riots, which was uh, taking place in, in the Northern Cape, uh, in, uh, in Kimberley, okay. Okay, these are the protests. This, this is not the, uh, uh, the pictures from, from, uh, from, what, from, from the Edomites. Which are you so-called whites? Uh, your, your land being bring up, being taken from you. Okay, these are uh, the pictures, which is uh, we've been taken from the, for what has been happening, have been transpiring over the, the couple of uh, month, in a month or so. What has been happening, continuing still happening in Kimberley. Uh, the the protest march, okay, against sa service delivery from the for for, for the removal of a mayor, because you better believe. It, if if uh, if if uh, these race riots was happening, uh, the people's land was being was being seized. Guess what, man? There would be a hey. You you would know it. You would know of it. All right. You would know of it. On every single channel, it will be breaking news. All right. All right. And it says uh, there will be huge food shortages and riots on the streets. Okay. It says there will be. Meaning what it has not as of yet transpired, but it's coming to it's gonna to come to pass. Uh, we've been telling you the race race riots are coming. Isaiah 13 four, uh, 13 goes into that. It shall be as a chase road that no man taketh up. Uh, it says there will be huge food shortages and riots on the, on the streets following. Okay, you know you see you see how slick uh, the devil is. Okay, in fact, let me just get this scripture in the book of Psalms real quick. I don't have a lot of scriptures. I want just want to make this a uh, response video very quick. This is uh, Psalm seventy-three verse seven. It says their eyes stand out with fatness; they have more than they could wish. All right, you've you you've you've taken a bite for more than you can chew, Esau. You've corrupted the lands, the nations. Okay, oppressing a man and and his, and his in inheritance. Now the, the chickens are coming home to roost. Uh, it says uh, Psalms 73 and 8 says, They are corrupt and speak wickedly concerning op oppression. They speak lofty. Okay. It says they, they, <clears throat> says they, speak, says, uh, they, they set their mouth against the heavens and their tongue walketh through the earth. And this is part of their tongues walking through the earth right now. Uh, it says, There will be huge fo food, food so, so, uh, shortages and riots on the streets following. What the hell the, what are you trying to say, Esau? Let me read this again, all right? Let me read this thing slow. There will be huge food so, so shortages 
right, and riots on the streets. All right. Following plans <laughs> to seize uh, uh, to seize white uh, Edomites, uh, South, uh, white uh, South African farmers' land, it has been won. It's still going to happen either way because it's all prophetic. It has nothing to. It's like a, the, what what what's uh, what's uh, what's happening right now? It's all scriptural. Right? It's, it's part of the scriptures, man. Uh, these nations are remembering themselves. Uh, as Esau is, is beginning to show his horns, so shall the Mosai, okay, make sure that, look, man, you Edomites, you're going to be as a chase row quite soon, all right? So as the experts have said, the, the country will face uh, dire consequences if plans to alter the country's uh, constitution are, pu are pushed through, okay? And this whole thing is going through, uh, through the legislature, it's going through the parliament right now. So South Africa President Cyril Ramaphosa has recently announced plans to allow white people's land to be taken uh, without compensation. Uh, this will be distributed. It says then uh, it says it will then be distributed to black people to move uh, from up to move in, in uh, for, uh, to black people in a move. Ramaphosa said it will be good for the economy. But criticists worldwide have, have blasted the proposed change, okay, saying it will spark riots as well as deep economic recession. Because all, right. all these economies are going to crash. As, let me go down to this image. As police fires rubber bullets to disperse the crowd. Wait a minute, the crowd? What crowd? Shouldn't they say these, these are the, uh, police firing uh, those who are trying to grab the land? Did, see? You better be careful of ESOs when you when you go through these articles. Look, at the, there's a shopping bag over here. This is what happened. What's happening in Kimberley? They were busy. What they're doing are they doing? They're protests. They were looting stores, as normally what happens here here in South Africa. All right. There's a uh, Ian uh, Cameron from S South African Trade Union of Africa Forum. Okay, of which is nothing but a bunch of Edomites. Okay, says uh, said we are really uh, heading for a state of anarchy if something does not change drastically. Okay, this place is falling, so you, you, you better wake up, man. All right? it says, I'm convinced this year we'll see between 21,000 and 22,000 people having been having been murdered in the past year. Wait a minute. I'm convinced this year we'll see between 21 and 22,000 people having been murdered in the past year. All right? You're convinced. So is, is this the, the stat, the, the truth? Okay, the facts? All right? Making no sense as says there are places where the police simply refuse to act. What are those places? Why why why, why are those places are not being uh, being uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Are not acting upon such such, such things? Why why not these places? Whatever whatever so whatever whatever province within these nine provinces we have in South Africa, why why are you not quoting those those places and provinces? Okay, and those townships or suburbs. You see. Yeah, man, your tongue is walking throughout the earth, but he's not going to have it. So there are those who are, going, who are not going to be deceived by you. All right? It says, uh, there, there, it says there are places where the, the police simply refuse to act. They don't know the law well enough to refuse to apply it to the logical reasoning when it comes to defending the people's property, right? What property? Stolen land? Uh, removing the landmark, the scripture says, "Cursed shall be the man that removed the landmark." And all the, the congregation say, "What?" Says, "What?" Well, Aman. All right. Says the says there are also fears South Africa could become a <laughs> pierced uh, state, uh, which other countries refuse to trade with it. Because we, because because twenty four, the effort has been given into the hands of the wicked. This whole global system, they can easily sanction you, just like what happened in Zimbabwe. Okay, Zimbabwe never went down because uh, the Edomites, the so-called whites, were uh, the land got got, got uh, removed from 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 them, which they unjustly gained. No, it's but it was because of the sanctioning, because uh, the effort has been given into the hands of the wicked. Uh, the supporters of Zimbabwean op uh, opposition MDC alliances take uh, anyway. Says uh, let me see over here. It says a lot of foreign countries that have already uh, contacted us as an organization say if you know what enough. Let me let me just go here. These are the images from the Kimberley protest march. Uh, this this is where they, they gather these images from. All right, they're trying, trying to chop these things up, making 
worse than they are. But guess what? The, uh, these Canaanite so-called South Africans, all right? The thing, what's happening right now, uh, guess what's going to happen, my man? When they finally start seeing you, your propaganda, your bullshit, they're going to realize these devils don't change. They're fucking liars. Psalms 58. Okay, the wicked are born estranged from the womb. They speak lies as soon as they be born. All right? So they're gonna real. They're gonna, so so basically, this is gonna just gonna make things even worse. Whatever, whatsoever you do, man, you just playing into the hands of your heart, Ashmi or Shai. Uh, you help them to to to, uh, to put more 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 wood and fuel to to, to the fire. All right, and that's beautiful, right there. Uh, amen. That will all praises on and glory be unto your heart, Ashmi or Shai, Ashem Rakakatash. That will also to the other supporters, great most soul shalom to sincere Akim, shalom shalom shalom. Because uh, these race riots are coming. Uh, you better believe globally on a global scale. Uh, and, and you realize you've been scattered among these guys, among these so-called South Africans, these Canaanites. And those of you coming from the, from, from the West Coast and okay, from, from, from Nigeria, from, 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 all, from, from, from the West Coast, okay, you, you coming here. Guess what? If you don't get right, man, your help ask me, Asha, going to fuck you up. All uh, right? He's going to use these nations, man. You're going to fall by the sword. All uh, right? You're going to fall by the sword, man. Because uh, a lot of you, you hear, okay, some a, a lot of you for no good reasons, you know, doing shit. You, you better, you better repent. The word has gone out. All right, shalom.